I think I'll begin with English maybe and speak Hindi at the end. That way we will have represented quite a few languages. We just have the pleasure of hearing two other of our southern languages. So, uh, Mr. Kanisha Yusuf Mastan, President of the Tamil Sangam Association of Poland. Mr. Akkal, Chandra Akkal, um, President of the Poland Telugu Association. All members, all guests represented here. My good friend Mr. Janusz Bilinski, my good friend Madam Margujata Bonikowska, my colleague from the Polish Embassy in New Delhi, and friends. So it's a, it's a very good day. We are meeting today. It's uh, to celebrate Diwali together. Diwali, I think we can fairly say the most major festival of our country with its many festivals. And um, the new year begins for some in India. I know Tamil New Year will be in April. It's a, it's a good time, it's a time of beginnings and it's a time of celebration. I want to say, I'll be very brief, when I was on my way here this morning, I got the good news that um, the Indian economy has crossed the $4 trillion mark. It is now in absolute terms worth uh, US dollars 4 trillion. And as you know, Poland is, uh, Poland has shown consistent growth over 30 years, including during the pandemic. And even today they say the Polish uh, rate of growth is uh, better probably than anyone else in any other country in Europe. So for all of you who have the good fortune to be associated with one or the other or both, of these economies, it's a good time. It's a good time to be here in Poland. It's a good time to be playing this role that you all play, or being the bridge between India and Poland. It's a good time to be alive, right? Let's hear it. Well, um, I just want to say a very small message to all of my Indian friends here. Uh, something I say often, as Indians in Poland, those of you who are Polish citizens, of course, you the, the, the requirements on you are clear. You have to be good, responsible citizens of Poland while also having your cultural and other contacts with your, mother, you know, your, your former motherland. Those of you who are still Indian citizens, you have to be a, a very responsible bridge between the two countries. It goes without saying that of course you must pay your taxes, of course you must follow the law, of course that is understood, you're all doing it. But I do want to say to you that while you're in Poland, it's important that you add value to the society you live in. Christmas is coming now. You know, it's not so important to be part of the Christmas festivities, but it is important to be part of the charitable endeavors for Christmas. That is very important. You, your company where you work, your neighborhood where you live, they must see that you feel that your emotions are invested with your neighbors and with your society, with the community you live in, as much as it is with Tamil Sangha Association or the you know, Telugu Association. That is important. I mentioned the other day also to, to, to my friends, I was with um, family members and I was just walking on one Sunday about two months ago. It was warm weather in the central. And I saw a long line of people who were queued up and somebody was distributing food to them. And I went a bit closer and I saw because the food looked Indian to me. It looked like it was chana and it looked like roti. So I went close and I saw that yes, it was three Indian men led by a Sikh gentleman. I forget his name. He's been here many years. And he was just, he says, I just, I, I chatted with him and he said, yes, I just do this every Sunday. You know, many of these people are homeless and it's nice for them to have a hot meal. So yeah, I come here and do this every Sunday. I give them a hot lunch. It was a long view. It was a, it was a very beautiful sight to see. And uh, yeah, it was a good hot meal. Three or four of our Indian brothers were there serving, cooking, not cooking, it was just boxes. So I, um, I do want to say that it's important that you do useful endeavors, that everyone in the society sees you as adding value, adding sweetness to the Polish national life, 
and to the community life is very important. So that's all. I just want to say continue doing the good work that you are doing. Continue please to be in touch with us, my colleagues and me at the embassy. Um, and um, continue to be in a proper interaction with us and with your, your families back home. So I will just finish this here. I will say my alphans and I just want to say this to you. आप सब को हमारी तरफ से मेरे एम्बेसी में सहकारी गण की तरफ से भी आप सब को दिवाली की बहुत शुभकामनाएं, बहुत बधाई। लक्ष्मी जी आपको आप पर अपनी कृपा बनाए रखें, आप भले भूलें और शांति और अमन के माहौल में हम लोग आगे बढ़ें। पोलैंड और इंडिया के बीच में जो आप दोस्ती का हाथ और एक एक दोस्ती का एक ब्रिज बनाते हैं उसको कायम रखें उसको और मजबूत करें और इसी तरह आगे बढ़ें थैंक यू वेरी मच धन्यवाद